Hi, my name is Kalyani and I'm from Acute Data Systems. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create and print sales order for Sage 100. Today, we'll be covering the following topics. Enter the sales order, printing the sales order, and verify the order in customer maintenance. Let's take a look. To create a sales order, we'll go into the sales order module, then on the main tab, and click on the sales order entry task. You'll be brought to the sales order entry window. Click the next order number button and we will select the order type to be the standard order. Now let's look up for the customer who has placed the sales order. So let's suppose Lanson Bikes is the customer. And let's go ahead and go on the address tab. If we have no modifications to be made for the bill to and the ship to address, we will move on to the lines tab. In the lines tab, we will enter the products and services that we are selling to the customer. Suppose we sold Lance and Bikes two light bulbs. So we will enter the item code of two light bulbs in this item code field. Let's look up for this item. There it is and let's select this item. Um, Lance and Bikes ordered two light bulbs, so let's enter the quantity two. Click on enter, select okay. Here we see the unit price of each light bulb is $10 and the total amount is displayed over here, which is $20. You can also insert a comment here saying that these are two light bulbs. And later on, you can say accept. This will take you to the totals tab, which will show you the review of the order that has been made. And if there are any changes or modifications that need to be made, you can do it over here. Before you click on accept again, let's click on the quick print button or the print order button. This will print the order which is currently existing, which is the order for Lance and Bikes. So let's go ahead and click on print order. Say yes if you want to save changes. And this will take you to this window where you can preview the order. This is the sales order preview where you see the company that we are selling it to, which is Lance and Bikes. And let's go down below. This is the item, which is the bulbs, which is the item code. We are selling two quantities. The price for each light bulb is $10 and for two light bulbs, the total amount is $20. Let's close out of this. So this is how you enter the sales order. In order to verify the sales order that you have placed, you can check in the accounts receivable module. So let's go on to the accounts receivable module in the main and then click on customer maintenance. Let's look up for the customer Lance and Bikes. And we will go to the sales order tab over here. And you can see the entry that is being made for this particular customer. If you have any questions or suggestions, then leave us a comment below or contact us for more information. Thank you for watching.